So let's graph the equation here, y equals 4x. We're going to use a table of values. If you need help graphing this with slope-intercept form, there's a link in the description and at the end of this video. So y equals 4x. I'm going to put values in for x. We'll multiply them by 4. We'll figure out y, and then we'll have x and y. We'll graph it, and we'll have the graph for y equals 4x. So let's start out with 0. It can be any number, but I like 0 because if we have 0 for x, 4 times x, 4 times 0, that's just 0. And I know that's going to fit on the graph here. How about just 1? 4 times 1, that means y is going to be 4. And how about negative 1? 4 times negative 1 would give us negative 4. So I just made these numbers up here so that they would fit on the graph. Okay, 0, 0. So if we put 0, 0, that's right here. If x is 1 and y is 4, we're right there. And you could just graph with two points. I like to do three in case I made a mistake. Negative 1, x. Negative 4, y. You can see our line there for y equals 4x. Let's put a line through that. And we'll put arrows, show that it goes to infinity. And that is the line for the equation y equals 4x. You could put any values in for x. You get a value for y, and it'd be somewhere on this line. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.